Fuckers in the house. Shout out to everybody in the building. Shout out to Fry Yourself. Shout out to Vaulting TV. Shout out to CLNE. You know what I'm saying? He said he's smoking. Vaulting TV said I'm smoking blue gelato. This B goes. Oh, yeah. You already know. You already know. Cito coming with the vibes all the time and shit. But we're going to get into the conversation today. You know what I'm saying? And also, you know, welcome to Let's Build Infinity. You know what I'm saying? We did 1 through 12. So after that, there will be no numbering for these episodes. These episodes are infinite. You know what I'm saying? You heard from hell that I was sent for me. I went through it. Uh, I went through it, uh, burning the sins of the murder the instruments. Now I'm trying to repent from it. But when I hit a beat, I'm tempted to make another attempt at it. I'm infinite. <laughs> Shout out to Eminem, Gemini ass. I think he's a Gemini. But yeah, let's get to it though. Or is it, what is Eminem? Let's see what Eminem. What, what's Eminem sign? Eminem was actually one of my first favorite rappers. She no cap. Libra. Oh shit, he a Libra. Damn. Shout out to Eminem. Shout out to L. Logan in the house. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, we gonna get into the motherfucking um. We gonna get into the motherfucking topic today. 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 And we're going to talk about choosing a fucking woman or a man, okay? Because you need to know what you actually doing and how we actually coming, okay? You know what I'm saying? When we get into these concepts of man and woman, because, you, you know what I'm saying? We're not even man and woman, pretty much. It's like, you know, I mean, we use that as a motherfucking term, but we're we're actually either just female or or or, or male, masculine or feminine. And so when a man, you know what I'm saying, a man, that is a word that was created and that we started calling ourselves that, you know what I'm saying? Now, you didn't create this word, but you just took it on as normal um, because, you know what I'm saying, it made sense for you to do that. You know what I'm saying? But ultimately, we just got masculine traits and feminine traits. You know what I'm saying? And that's how we determine based on what we receive from that with somebody is. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, when it comes to choosing a woman or a man, you know what I'm saying? What is a man? Now, you know what I'm saying? When we get into the Jewish literature, you know what I'm saying? Because you need to know that's who created these terms, some Jews. You know what I'm saying? When we get to man, what they were pointing to and what they were talking to about, you know what I'm saying? When it, came to, when it comes to that topic, a man just represents a masculine principle, which is a vision, um, an idea, a light. You know what I'm saying? Something your spirit can go into to be aware of itself. So a vision, you know what I'm saying? That's the masculine principle. Man's externalized 
You know what I'm saying? You know, obviously. We got we got dicks and shit, you know what I'm saying? And women, you know, y'all the internal nature, you know what I'm saying? Y'all more in tune with the emotions and feelings, where the masculine, you know what I'm saying, might be more logical, make more sense, be, you know what I'm saying, as far as the vision-wise, you know what I'm saying? Now, we both got these elements, to, you know, together. You know, we can both got these, um, we both got these traits, you know what I'm saying? Shout out to Dolo, you know what I'm saying? He said, uh, men are 40%. Uh, feminine, sixty percent masculine, and the women were uh, uh, sixty percent feminine and forty percent masculine. You know what I'm saying? Okay, getting on with these topics and shit like that. I just like these cards in my hand. I ain't gonna pull none. We ain't better do no tarot pull, but you know what I'm saying. Some might pop out, so you know what I'm saying. I might show y'all what the vibe is. Oh, some trying to pop out right there. Okay. But yeah, getting on to the topic. So man just represents vision, information, idea, light. For you, this is actually what the word means. Uh, for your spirit to go into and become aware of itself. Okay, when a, a woman is a, uh, the receiving principle, information you can see, you can't see. Okay, emotions and feelings, internalization, um, the unaware principle, aka the re reflecting the idea. You know what I'm saying? Reflecting the uh, the man. Now, now you got these principles yourself, so don't get lost in male and female. What I'm saying, just, just, just get on the energy. What I'm, what I'm pointing to, okay? So when we got, you know, what I'm saying this. At the end of the day, a woman will always reflect the best man's visions at the moment, okay? So, like I said, a man is an idea, and we can see that with most of, you know, what I'm saying everyday, everyday things with the shadow government. You know what I'm saying? Uh, we see that with Eight of Diamonds. Eight of Diamonds, y'all, we giving time to a gift, all right? That's what popped out. But yeah, but at the, um, um, so yeah, like I said, we can see um, most of this concept to be true, you know what I'm saying, when we look at y'all, you, know, you know what I'm saying? So your spirit, you know what I'm saying, was actually powering your body, we can say that, you know what I'm saying? Your spirit, your your motherfucking, is your, your masculine principle. You know what I'm saying? Your will, your your vision, your 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 um ability to be able to see, you know what I'm saying, to externalize and it's happening through your feminine daughter of men. You know what I'm saying? Your your body and shit. So this receives, this takes in the information. Okay? So like what I said is at the end of the day, a woman will always reflect the best man visions at the moment. And we can see this every day. Well, most of y'all are doing what the shadow government ideas are, you know what I'm saying, aka you're the receiver, so their vision on how to how to survive you know, uh, how you should get up and go to work for them every day that uh, you should get up and, you know, do this A, B, and C, and you know what I'm saying you know what I'm saying, uh, we always you all, we gonna always reflect that you know what I'm saying, so that's 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 a clear way to see it, a woman will all, even, you don't even gotta be a woman to understand this concept you, you a man, right, so if you a man and you get up and do what they want you to do every day and shit like that, you know what I'm saying? You don't have no own, you know what I'm saying? You're going to reflect, you know what I'm saying, that man's vision. What I tell y'all, a man was an idea, a vision. You know what I'm saying? So you only can see yourself in that light. You only can see yourself in the way. So your body is going to follow. Where the mind goes, the body follows, okay? You know what I'm saying? Where the mind goes, the body follows, okay? And so, like I said, we're talking about man and woman, okay? Now, when it gets to choosing man or a woman when it gets to choosing a man or woman um um man chooses a woman to nurture and take um care of his light okay so we can we we get we get we get um into i guess 3d a little bit more you know what i'm saying when it comes to what we be calling men and um, women so a man chooses a woman to nurture and take care of his light his vision his idea and, and sustain of his Sustain it, aka his idea, his self, you know what I'm saying, his light, his vision, okay? A woman chooses a man because of his vision and resonates with, with that, you know what I'm saying? It resonates with that, sustains it, you know what I'm saying? Um, run, you know, um, 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 sustain it, you know what I'm saying? Be be there for the, for, for the ride, for the vision, you know what I'm saying? Vibrate. A, a woman, a man is like a frequency. A woman is a vibration, so she's going to vibe the frequency. You know what I'm saying? Okay, moving on. So when you when you don't choose, uh, 
from these aspects, you leave yourself to be open to failure because your starting point was wrong. Okay, so nine time, times out of ten, y'all vision was flunked out, and the man didn't have no vision, or, or you know, what I'm saying he had a vision that was flunked out. You know, what I'm saying aka the shadow government's vision, and the woman just settled for whatever. Shout out to No Thing Sammy. Shout out to Big Posture. Yeah, so yeah, so like I said. The man, nine times out of ten, y'all vision was flunked out. The man didn't have no vision. And the woman just settled for what whatever was giving her dick at the moment. Attention. And that's how we get, like, abusive relationships. That's how we get unhappy relationships. And that's how we get um, broken families. Now, this is not 99, 90, 98.7% of us. So, it's not like I'm trying to jump on anybody or anything for the most part. I'm just kind of keeping it real. You know what I'm saying? I'm just kind of keeping it real. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah. So the woman just settled what was uh, whatever was giving her a good dick. You know what I'm saying? Attention. And you know what I'm saying? That's how we get abusive relationships. That's how we get unhappy relationships and also broken families. You know what I'm saying? That's how we get that shit. Okay. So. Now, somebody got some thoughts right now that they learning. You know what I'm saying? And it's a, it's a learning process. So, you know what I'm saying? That's what's going on. You got a third thought that you don't like that, you know what I'm saying, is negative. But it's something you got to learn. Though. You're learning about the way you was thinking. Or whatever. That's the card that came out. But, yeah. So, when you don't um, so when you don't choose from these aspects, you, um, you know what I'm saying? You leave yourself to be open to failure because your starting point was wrong. So nine times, nine times out of 10, y'all vision was flunked out. The man didn't have no vision and the woman just settled for whatever was, was giving her dick attention. And that's how we get, you know what I'm saying? Abusive, unhappy and broken families. Okay. So that lets you know right there. It's not about the flesh. Okay. Um, the spirit will break a motherfucking, a motherfucking family up real quick. You know what I'm saying? Real quick, <laughs> real swift. And it may seem like it's forever, but it's going to do its job. That's why we got, you know what I'm saying, people with, you know what I'm saying, different families, different kids, different dads, different moms and shit like that. Because I, at the end of the day, it's not about that. So it's not about the flesh. It's not about the flesh. The spirit will break that shit up. Okay. Um, now, what it got to be about is about the mission being done or the vision. You know what I'm saying? And that's when y'all come together. So even if you, even if, um, um, even if you are, like I said, for the most part, it got to be about the vision. It got to be some y'all up hope, but we're going to get to that. So my next point is just if, if a man has kids already, AKA responsibilities, a woman coming um, on board to nurture that, like say if you a man, you already got kids, a woman to coming on board to nurture his vision as a father and, um, um, even if you don't got kids, but this is what a woman does in general. If you're a man that are, already has kids, but look at kids as like, you got some responsibilities, you know what I'm saying? Not, not just physical kids, but also, you know what I'm saying? You got things that you got to do. You know what I'm saying? You got things that you got to, you know what I'm saying? So a woman coming, coming on board, it, the reason why she's coming on board is to nurture his vision as a father. You know what I'm saying? Um, in his circumstances and situations as her own. And so I'm not saying that like if you are um if you are um coming in in this way, I'm not saying that you gotta play mama, but you are but you are taking these um as your own and looking for the best outcome. You know what I'm saying? So, like I said, just as if a man already has kids or responsibilities, a woman coming on board to nurture his vision as a father and his cir um, is coming on board to nurture his visions as a father in circumstances and situations as her own. I'm not saying that she got to play mama, but as her own in a way as she's looking for the best outcome. Then, so then on the reverse side, if you a man um, um, and you pick a woman with kids, um, you're picking a woman because of her nurturing ability, her ability to sustain and her ability to uh, motivate you and what you're doing and hold you down. OK, so, yeah. So. Um, so at the end of the day, a woman should have her own idea of how the seed, which is the idea, should be taken care of and let the man know when he's going to extreme with the with the vision they have. OK, you know what I'm saying? So. 
I'm going to repeat that. A woman should have her own idea of the seed, the idea. I mean, her own idea of the seed, that light that the man is projecting. You know what I'm saying? Um, and how it should be taken care of and let the man know when he's going to extreme but with the vision that they share. Okay. A man should have a vision or ideas, not just. Uh, and so a man should have a vision for a woman. Um or ideas and not just kids, you know what I'm saying? Not just ideas of kids and shit that she can share for and nurture, that she can care for and nurture. I'm sorry, I said share, but that she can care for and nurture, okay? And that way they become true partners, okay? That way they become true partners. Like I said, it's not about the flesh, it's about the vision, it's about the idea, it's about, um, you know what I'm saying? You know, this idea that y'all got or whatever y'all got in mind. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah. Now, the problem. Let's get to the problem. So, we talked about a little bit of the problems, but the problem is the woman agrees, okay? So, this is how we get the, the shit with, like, you know what I'm saying? For the most part, uh, you know, we get the broken families thing. So this is how we get the broken families, okay? The problem is um, the woman agrees, but she doesn't totally do totally agree or trust his vision, aka ability to lead, let alone herself and ability to nurture herself. Okay. So that's the fucking problem right there. Because the problem is, first of all, like I said, we, we, we got the starting point of how y'all fuck up in that way. You know what I'm saying? We got the starting point. Shout out to Balls Baby Jess. Shout out to Aries Full Moon. But yeah, Shout out to Nas Global 20. But the problem is the woman agrees, but doesn't totally agree or trust his vision, a.k.a. the ability to lead. And that and sometimes she, she be right because motherfucking man's thoughts be flunked out. Um, ability to lead or alone or let alone herself ability to nurture herself. So that could be the problem. You know what I'm saying? In that area. Not nah, that'd be the problem. OK. And th that'd be what the broken families be about. You know what I'm saying? The woman don't trust, you know, the motherfucker, this man's ability to lead. You know what I'm saying? He ain't doing what the fuck he need to do. He ain't making, he ain't giving no excitement, no, no you know what I'm saying? He not leading. You know what I'm saying? A man is supposed to be a vision, a light. Okay. And the problem with the man is he don't have no good vision or even yield any results <laughs> because he don't believe in his vision due to mediocrity. And what's normal to achieve. So the man usually don't be having no vision because for the most part, he only be seeing through the lens of the shadow government. You know what I'm saying? He be seeing through motherfucking, I don't know what the fuck, five of hearts. But you got a motherfucking emotional opportunity that you got coming up. So, you know what I'm saying? You got an emotional opportunity and this for some positive emotions. Okay, so yeah, let's recap that. So you're giving time to a motherfucking gift right now, but the gift is motherfucking you learning about some negative thoughts that you got going on, but they just negative thoughts. They just negative thoughts. So don't let these don't let these negative thoughts take you from this opportunity. You know what I'm saying? This opportunity to be, you know what I'm saying, to, to experience positive emotions. Okay. But yeah, let's get it. Um, so yeah, the problem with the man is that he don't have no good visions or even yield any results because he don't believe in his vision due to mediocrity. You know what I'm saying? He could be programmed. You know what I'm saying? He could think, you know what I'm saying? They build y'all man and woman. You know what I'm saying? They tell y'all, if you got this degree, you're a man. You know what I'm saying? If you got this, you know what I'm saying? Now I don't even got shit to do with it. That's why how we got motherfuckers with the most money being hoes. So, you know, it ain't even about that. Shout out to Scammy Sosa in the game. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, it don't even about, it don't even be about that. You know what I'm saying? Sh shout out to literally G Griffith. But um, the problem is with the man is he don't have no good vision or, or even yield any results because he don't believe in his vision due to mediocrity. He can't, and he don't know how to lead and he don't know, um, and, and, and he just, ba or he just bases his vis vision on what's normal to achieve. And I'm not saying your vision got to be extra weird and shit like that, but it got to be successful. You a man. That's what you're here to do. Okay. So yeah. So GM and I don't, and I ain't saying I ain't saying successful in a way y'all think. You know what I'm saying? Successful is your own way of success. You know what I'm saying? Now, how flunked out is that is based on is going to be based on your judgment and how your ability to 
to be able to do something with your motherfucking self. Okay, let's then we get do let's get to the GMO shit because GMO uh, GMO woman has no intention of keeping that vision that seed. Or growing with that vision. So these is like bitches that be like getting niggas pregnant and they don't got no... <laughs> yes, yeah, getting niggas pregnant. And they don't got no motherfucking um, intention of keeping that vision, that man, that idea and growing with it. AKA they using him for his finance, they using him for his money or whatever and shit like that. Nice saying that ain't wrong, but I'm just saying it's GMO. GMO man has no intention of keeping the garden, AKA giving this woman emotional care. You know what I'm saying? And attention, sunlight, as he should be there to guide what's growing. Okay? You know what I'm saying? He should be there to guide what's growing. You know what I'm saying? What's growing out of the, out of her garden. You know what I'm saying? Of 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 what you know what I'm saying, your idea and the vision of that what what of hers was. Now, everything changes though. That now that's the thing. Everything do change. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to Moselle. Everything thing do change, so it's like, you know what I'm saying? We and we live in a tricky world. We live in a tricky world. So things do change. So that's the that's the only thing. It's like ain't nothing gonna be able to be fixated forever. You gonna leave this motherfucking body too. You know what I'm saying? In some way, shape, or form. But uh but yeah. Um but yeah, so that's what that's that's what we talking about when we get to choosing a woman. Or man. And I'm Kel Cito. You know what I'm saying? And I'm hopping off this live. I hope you enjoyed it. Um, anybody got any questions we can build. You know what I'm saying? That's what this about. You know what I'm saying? If y'all want to build on the topic. If y'all want to hop on the live. Or whatever. And if not. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. But let me go ahead and add this up. Real quick, so you got four, five, that's nine, then you got eight, um, then you got eight, so that's nine. Oh, so this is Sagittarius energy in general. So shout out to Sagittarius because we in the Sag new moon. I'm gonna actually hop on and do the new moon tomorrow and shit like that. I um, me Saint Uno. Uh, Dave Beyond TV, we dropping an I'm Obscure video tomorrow, so make sure y'all tap in with that. You know what I'm saying? It'll be on motherfucking YouTube, so making sh make sure y'all keeping y'all eyes and ears open. You know what I'm saying? And uh, yeah, so other than that, get y'all little ass in the game.